A big installation is going on right now at a downtown Orlando landmark. This is a live look from our city cameras at the Dr. Phillips Center. Just minutes ago, crews used two cranes to lift a 142 ton steel section of roof. Now this is all part of the construction for the new Steinmetz Hall Theater and new Six's Amanda Castro found out what it's going to take to make this all happen. Roz Mullen is used to hearing the sounds of construction. She tutors students at a church near the Dr. Phillips Center for the Performing Arts every weekend. And for the last two years, she's watched crews build a new phase of the facility from the ground up. We have just been watching it go up beam by beam. It really acts as the spine for the entire roof. This isn't a simple undertaking. Crews shut down part of South Street Friday to get the cranes in place and it will take an entire day to get the piece up and stabilized. Construction workers building it 13 stories in the air. Bystanders watching and taking pictures, amazed at how it's all coming together. Seeing them build the trusses are on the ground for quite a while, it'll be exciting to see them in place. Deepak says the new Steinmetz Hall is a 1,700-seat acoustic theater and is still on schedule to open sometime next year, continuing the center's mission to support the arts across Central Florida. We're just so grateful to be part of that and to really be helping that move forward and progressing. Mullen says she can't wait to see the finished product and she's already looking forward to future performances in the new space. It's going to be a showpiece for Orlando. In Orlando, Amanda Castro getting results. News 6.